Well, hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to Life of Wonders. This is Polo and I love making videos of dolls, always in Disney collectibles. And as always, if you like this kind of content and you feel like supporting the channel, then you already know what to do. So today we are going to be unboxing and reviewing in detail the new Inspired by Ariel or Ursula rather, <laughs> I would say. Ellie Forever doll as part of this series 3 or series 2 from Shop Disney. This is the second series that is produced by Shop Disney and the third um, wave of dolls uh, taking into account the Jack specific ones. Anyway, and so again, this is Ariel slash Ursula inspired. Uh, we already have the Ursula insp or inspired by Ursula by Jack specific and I love that one especially the base doll I just love her to pieces and then right here we have the 2023 storybook Ariel and so as always we'll be reviewing our new doll and the accessories and everything else and then I will be trying out the fashion pieces that Ariel can wear uh, just to look casual with this Disney bounding. So yeah, this is the box again. We already know it So inspired by Ariel logo <laughs> um, a little sketch um, a piece of artwork for Ariel and it is the very same one that we're getting right here super cute if you ask me and I always turn these into bookmarks and I've given um, plenty away for the festive season to my friends and my family and I think it's a really nice idea and then right over here we have the promo picture of our girl and this is the original inspired by Tiana one um, but this time um, she's having these streaks of lavender or purple hair and let's see how it feels and then here we have the whole squad the glow in the dark feature anyway can't wait so i'll be taking her out of the box and we'll take it from there all right and here we have our girl and accessories out of the box and i have to say that she does not disappoint even though i am reviewing her last <laughs> um but seriously i am very happy with the pieces and especially with her as a base doll is very pretty and i think i prefer this one over the previous one um the hair feels so much nicer and softer and i love the way it's been arranged and i love the um, pop of color for um, those streaks in lavender so let's get into it as we're getting closer uh, we can see that she comes with these glasses which are really cool they are having like a shape of like a shell and there's a number effect um, from purple to green and i think they look pretty cool. Um, they're probably like my favorite glasses so far uh, from any other Illy Forever doll. Now, when it comes to her face, she's gorgeous. It's very similar to the previous one, uh, but she's gorgeous. And with the addition of makeup that we have the metallic sheer um, transition from green to like very light lavender, it's very nice and then this time around um, there's those uh, little stars with the shell as well adorning uh, one of our upper cheeks and so that is very cool I like her so so much and I wasn't so sure um, about the streaks on her but now that I see it in person I think um, it, they frame her uh, face so very nicely and they're loose and they have a little bit of a wave there so yeah I'm very happy about that now the ears are super cool obviously this is giving me both Ariel and Ursula it's almost like I feel the whole thing has been inspired in this moment like in the moment of do um, do we have a deal um, so that is why we're getting like mixed things so there are things that will remind us of Ariel and things that will remind us of Ursula because it's just basically taken from this moment so we have um, okay yeah basically yeah literally I don't know if, if someone um, 
has already pointed this out but anyway this is like uh, reminiscent of the crown from Ursula but right here we have a tentacle and right here we have a tail so definitely it's half Ursula half mermaid like quite literally uh, the back isn't texture or anything but uh, it's well painted and um, yeah I, I love these ones and I just noticed those elements so there's a tentacle and a tail now moving down we find these I think we already got this one in gold but I'm not certain uh, but probably with the previous um, Ellie inspired by Ariel doll from Shop Disney this one is metallic with um, green and purple for the tail um, that is the necklace and then uh, well again needless to say the articulation is the same as for any other Shop Disney doll um, I love the blouse this time around I think is a really nice um, interesting construction with the ruffles um, for both sleeves and then the triangular sort of like crop moment here with more ruffles and then it perfectly uh, it, it velcros in the back now um, moving more like uh, down I, I want to show you the shorts first so they're supposed to be like a pleathery material they're very soft and I think they're really nicely constructed it's just that they are not hemmed at the bottom which is a bit of a pity and I hope they don't fray as much but to the side we can see um, the really nice print of the tentacles from um, so again this would be like an inspiration from the top the bra uh, from Ariel and this is more like the tentacles of Ursula so we have half and half here and then she comes with this really cute um, seashell um, shaped bag which I love that has like this super open um, slit here because you can just place anything um, inside without the worry of just getting it stuck and then we have a chain and the strap it's all plastic but it's nicely painted and then we have this other um, like a charm I think and so many people um, haven't figured out um, what it is but it, what I think it is is again we have the silhouette of um, Ariel on the top and Ursula on the on at the bottom so it's again a combination of them both in this moment that we'll see right now in this jacket now the jacket it's super interesting i'm not a you know a big fan of sequins but i have to say that it looks pretty cool um now i think that the sequence is a reference to ariel's tail but then the sequence change color from green to purple and so the purple is more associated with as you can see they literally change color as you move it with um, um, Ursula and then we have this little fringe that it, it's also probably a little bit of like a touch of Ursula's tentacles and then underneath I've already cut the late I mean the yeah the tag because it was just like on the way but we have this really nice hidden um, it's actually line or at least just for the back portion with an aubergine uh, color satin and then the print is very high definition and it's just right about that moment of uh, trickery <laughs> so anyway that is the jacket and then the last um, pieces are these uh, wedges uh, like um, slight wedges which are super cool again we have the iridescent scales um, for the top part and then there's the platform in a purple color they're jellies um, and yeah I, I like them very much and now let's see uh, what I got as a surprise because again this is my final door and I don't know um, let's see so the legend, um, oh it's small, it's, it's something small, I don't know what it could be, 
well it's not as small <laughs> but yeah this is so cute so i believe these are cookies um so the ribbon um from mini and the pants from mickey and it comes in this white plate it's super cute i like it very much so i can't complain about it right now i will uh try these uh pieces on ariel and then i will try the whole ensemble on this doll and i'll give you my final thoughts by the way i just forgot to show you the back of the hair and this is uh, what it looks like and it's super soft it does not have any any gel whatsoever and so it's incredibly soft and that is something i very much like it doesn't feel as rough as the series one uh pigtails that she came with so and then the streak of um lavender um hair is really nicely braided with her black hair and i think that the length is it's very realistic and really cool quite long so i like that too and yes once again i simply love how these fashions fit the new 2023 storybook body i think it's just perfect for them and so wow i really really like it i mean i think that again without having to pay a fortune for this designer i don't know premiere or just to see them wearing something different this is a really nice alternative to dress your favorite princess or character uh, with these pieces of disney bounding um, items which i think look amazing like the ears fit perfectly um, the princesses uh, hats and then the fashion pieces are just like perfection the only thing is that these lights are a little bit loose but that's to expect uh, but other than that I don't know she's just so awesome I love her I really love her it's giving me these funky um, vibes that I love so yeah I hope you've um, enjoyed seeing how these pieces look on Ariel Okay, so final thoughts. I like this doll quite a lot. Uh, again, I think it's been an upgrade from the first one as the base doll. And I also love the fashion pieces that came with her and that it's also inspired by both Ariel and Ursula. So that I like very, very much. And I would totally recommend her. I think that probably my least favorite has been the inspired by Sven uh, for this series. But anyway, just hoping and looking forward to more uh, creative takes uh, for these lines. So yeah, I hope uh, you've enjoyed this review and it's been helpful. And if that is the case, well, don't forget to give me a like to support the channel. Subscribe to it if you haven't already. And let me know what you think in the comment section down below because as always i will read your comments and i will get back to all of them for now stay safe and i'll see you all very very soon bye bye